could say that uh, at the beginning I felt like a pioneer in the space program because no woman had ever been um, involved in such detailed programming uh, as I have and uh, I feel like I've paved the way for a lot of women in business today that are leaders and uh, so forth because I worked with all men, uh, engineers and um, uh, doctors and uh, so forth and people like uh, Jack and uh, he's been tremendous <clears throat> in helping me. But uh, and then starting to lecture on the space program to be sure and tell people where their tax dollars were going. That was very, very important for the space program to keep on, uh, you know, in the, um, finding a lot more on these spin-offs of the space program. And believe me, there were a lot of advantages that we have all received from the space program. And it uh, still goes on during the uh, space shuttle program. The, we're still learning, we're still uh, trying to make room for all our people that want to live elsewhere, like on the moon, in a nice crater, creating um, vegetation to give us oxygen, take out our carbon dioxide, and uh, so forth. I'll be the first to go as a Celia knot. A Celia knot is an older person who doesn't worry about coming back. So I have to, another person who would like to go, and uh, I know Jack might like to go. <laughs> but anyway, uh, I've never given up hope for a ride in space. <laughs>